we think about STEAM education, you really can't think about it in isolated segments or fragments of programs. It really is a lot more about the holistic approach and mindset that we have as we're considering how we prepare our students for the 21st century. And we really can't just think about um, the 21st century as the future anymore, it's now. So we have a wide range of programs for students. Students who are um, uh, new to the country, we have ESOL programs for, so English as a second language um, programs in place, and students can then take their core content classes through those ESOL support classes. And in terms of looking at the students needs as they become adults it's truly important that they have these opportunities to express themselves in a number of skill areas in a number of different ways because the vision and mission of the school is very much dedicated to having our students fully be able to understand all of their abilities so that they can become lifelong learners and have skills and knowledge that will help them in their endeavors beyond high school. And so by constructing their own learning in that way, it really is preparing them uh, for ongoing uh, deeper learning in their future. But at the heart of that all is the belief in the student that they have the ability uh, to think more critically and that with that growth mindset. Fairfax County Public Schools, it's such a large school system. And I think that with the Fairfax City piece, you get, still get that very small town community feel from Fairfax City. It feels like a community of learners that is really connected from elementary school to middle school to high school. And I get just this sense that we're a part of a larger team. And so regardless of what your needs are or what challenges you face, you feel like you have someone you can go to for help. And you feel as though uh, you're going to be able to work through those challenges together. And so the courses that are in the high school very much stem off of the courses that come from the middle school. Also Fairfax County is very close to Washington DC so students have an excellent opportunity to go and actually see and live the history that we teach them in, in the classroom. Um, another big part about Washington DC that I find um, incredibly um, advantageous is that we also have a great just natural community around us in hiking and in, in waterfalls and trails so you sort of get the best of both worlds you get the city of Washington as well as you get the natural beauty that um, this part of the country has to offer all within a 10 mile radius of each other. We have a lot of opportunity for collaboration we have a lot of resources that are at our disposal and truly as large as the school system is Within uh, the school system here in the Fairfax Pyramid, it feels like a, a family. Um, as we move forward um, in future years, really looking at how we um, use technology to be a better servant to our students, if you will, how they can use technology in order to um, innovate, in order to think about um, currently what's out there and what's being created and what are some better structures, and creating programs that allow for that to happen. We also are always looking for what are ways that we can get better and that collaboration and that teamwork really looks for how can we work in different ways to meet the many needs of our students and to make sure that we always know that all of our students are all of our students and that our true success is success for all.